The Aquaibum State Governor, Pastor Umar Eno, has given the assurances of his administration's commitment to implement implementation of the Arise Agenda to create measurable impact in the state and the lives of the people. Speaking during the opening ceremony of the Aquaibum Dialogue and formal launch of the Arise Agenda at Ibom Icon Hotel and Golf Resorts, Uyo, the Governor described the agenda as not just a political manifesto, but a detailed and well-articulated governance blueprint that would enhance optimal utilization of the state's rich human and material resources to deliver for the state a vibrant, inclusive, diversified and highly industrialized economy. Chairman on the occasion, an Aquaibum born economic planning expert and one-time Minister of Budget and National Planning, Senator Odoma Ododoma, lauded Pastor Omar Enna's all-inclusive disposition to governance and scored the event as a fulfillment of the governor's campaign promise. I come here to see the roadmap, learn from our people, take that roadmap, go with the commissioners for a retreat, and then we can see what we are going to do. Together we'll fix a timeline, and then together we'll look for funding, and so that every commissioner will know what he or she has to do from this Arise agenda. And then when we come to implementation, I want to guarantee a quiet moment. The chairman, I want to guarantee you, and all our guests that trust me, we will implement. Uh, in preparation for chairing this summit, I have gone through the Arise Agenda Blueprint. I see that the blueprint seeks to achieve eight ambitious and lofty goals, driven by five aspirations, collectively referred to as the Arise Agenda. The agenda delineates 17 focal sectors to guide the delivery of these sector strategies and plans. It also identifies priority areas among other sectors that will deepen the development of the state. The Arise Agenda therefore sets out in a document the ambitious agenda of our Governor, Pastor Moino. Congratulations for the Arise Agenda. A former governor of the state, Obong Victor Atta, who commended the governor for the restoration of the Aquaibum dream that was beginning to fade, as encapsulated in his blueprint, formally handed over some documents to the governor, which he said comprises of how the ideas can be achieved and the methodologies needed for execution. He stressed that the governor needs true guidance for effective implementation. Former Minister of Petroleum Resources and Chieftain of the All Progressives Congress, at Kong Don Edibet, who also spoke at the event, described the pastor Umo Enel's gesture in bringing all together, regardless of political divide, as renewing the spirit of one acquiring. And I have read this arrest agenda, and all these items are in here. That is why I speak about a restoration of a dream that was beginning to fade. Thank you for bringing back the Aquaibon dream. Whenever you hear that word arise, something is expected. And what is expected from top of the word arise is execution, which is what the German call implementation. Once you hear that word arise, there's a next thing that will follow anywhere from the Holy Bible to a command to military to paramilitary. Once you hear that word arise, the next thing that follows is execution. So I believe we are all ready to join in executing that agenda that is spelled out for us. And what is expected of us, I can assure you, we must also have that sense of ownership of everything, which is what is lacking in Africa. We lack the sense of ownership. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.